In another story, Transparency International TI has released its latest corruption perception index, which sees Nigeria to scoring 24 out of 100. The index, which was published ex exclusively in Nigeria by the Civil Society Legislative Advocacy, CISLAC, was shared in Abuja yesterday. Stakeholders called on government to ensure improvement of the rating as it was the lowest the country has scored two years running. And here's more on the story. On Tuesday in Abuja, the Civil Society Legislative Advocacy Center published the latest Corruption Perception Index by Transparency International. Nigeria scored 24 out of 100 and went up four places in the rankings. The executive director of CISLAC, Awal Ibrahim, called for more focus on the other levels and branches of government and protection of anti-graft agency staff. We are, however, encouraging our country and even the anti-corruption agencies that we are very much uh, confident on the effort they are making. They are sacrificing their life, they are working, they are working without no life insurance, facing crooks and criminals. It is only in some few countries, including Nigeria, that you see whenever we release this report, that you see public officials will come and be insulting us that we say there's a corruption. Meanwhile, a week after or some few days after, you will see anti-corruption will catch one big tip. Then you ask yourself, are you not the one that is dismissing that there's a corruption in the country? There's no corruption in the, co in the country. So when you are dealing with dishonest public officials who have taken advantage of the lack of understanding of even, you know, uh, part against corruption by the regime, they turn to undermine even the government itself. Other stakeholders pointed out the positives of the government's fight against corruption. Money Laundering um, Prevention and Prohibition Act 2022 has helped to strengthen Nigeria's legal framework when it comes to the prevention and combating of money laundering and related crimes. The second strength um, which we have also seen is the stre um, resolve, strengthened resolve of anti-graft agencies despite political interference. So the Nigerian judiciary has also contributed to the challenges faced in tackling corruption in Nigeria. This was highlighted in 2022, which was which saw numerous election-related court processes. Actions that heightened the perception of corruption were also addressed. Prevalence of high provide corruption. The prevalence of high provide corruption remains a major challenge Nigeria currently faces. The recovery of uh, 30 billion naira from the former Accountant General of the Federation by the Economic and Financial Crimes Agency goes to underscore how deep corruption is entrenched in, Nigeria's, um, in Nigeria. In addition to this, is the failure to investigate and provide citizens with answers on previous leaks like the Face and Files, Panama Papers, the Paradise Papers and the Pandora Papers, which exposed how um, Nigerian officials, seven and former, violated the country's code of conduct laws. The Corruption Perception Index is a tool for measuring the levels of corruption in various countries around the world, and the country can score a maximum of 100 points and zero as the least. Zero indicates the worst performing country, while 100 is the best ranked.